Hey guys, this is PE tip number 36 and today I want to talk about how not, why you should not over pump with the bath mate extreme. Okay, so I'm going to just um, explain what I mean and then I'm going to go into my experiences with it and why I don't think it's a good idea. Alright, so what do I mean by over pump? Okay, you put it on and you know, you have the hand thing on, and you will, like that, and eventually it's going to max out. You're going to max out the pressure. It's it's not going to, it's not gonna, you're not going to be able to squeeze the handball anymore, and what you can do is you can pop it off, you know what I mean, you just pop it off, you'll heal, you heal the suction pop, and you can put it on, and you can continue pumping, okay? Um, so... So now that we understand what I mean by over pumping, um, this is my experience, guys. I have not. Now, what I mean right after each other, like you do it, and then like literally like four seconds later, you pop it off and you put it back on, and you squeeze again. That's what I mean by over pumping. Okay, if you if you do it like five minutes later or on the next pump, that's not what I'm talking about, guys. That's not that's not what I'm talking about. What I'm talking about is you you keep trying to go and go and go with a quick within a quick thirty seconds. Um, first of all, guys, I have not noticed when I have done this and I tried it. I noticed I did not gain any more length. Like, like, like nothing happened, basically, guys. Nothing happened. Okay, I didn't gain any more length. I didn't see any more girth gain, like in the in the cylinder. Um, a few times, my testicles got sucked into the chamber and it fucking hurt and it sucked and I had to take it off. Okay, that's that's a reason not to do it. But from the gain side, I didn't see anything. Um, so some of the some of the like, quote unquote negatives I've seen and these some of you might not consider this negatives I get way more water uh, uh, retention it seems that my testicles can get sucked into the thing and it really hurts and I have to take it off and the third thing is is I get a lot more of those red little dots like way more way more when I do it guys so all in all which is not good like I said water retention is not bad and the red dots aren't bad as long as you're not like you know you see them and you're like why am I keep abusing myself no um, I will just follow what the manual says, guys. Okay, so how I do it is I do originally, you guys. I just you fill it up. You know, you do. I do the uh, the uh, initial like pump like that. Okay, and then maybe a, give it like a thirty seconds, and then I take the hand pump and pump, 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 and then I just hold it. Um, I might do another hand pump like two minutes and thirty seconds in. And then at the five minute mark, you know, you release, you massage, and then you repeat it all over again two more times for a total of 15 minutes, right? You're only in the chamber for 15 minutes, guys. Um, and that's that's basically what I do. Um, like I said, the first couple of times I tried it, you know, you're playing around with it. You kind of like you kind of like the hand pump. Don't don't keep trying to pump, 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 pump the whole five minutes. You're in there the whole 15 minutes. You're not gonna get anything. You possibly could hurt yourself. Um, I think in the user manual it said it could cause some serious bruising. Uh, so just there's no there's no reason to like try to overdo it, guys. Um, just like I said, just follow the directions in the manual. Take your time and don't try to overdo it, guys. In fact, I feel like I have gained more. I've gotten better results with the chamber by under pumping, if that makes sense, than I have over pumping so that's my pe tip for the night guys um i will see you tomorrow for another tip peace out